Hey guys, what is up? Ioki here bringing you some more APMF support gameplay. Uh, they just buffed my girl APMF. I don't know why we're fighting this, but we are. Uh, should be an interesting level one. Here we go. We've already given them first blood. We got. We just got to focus this cane. There we go. We keep focusing them. Keep chasing. Beautiful root. Boom. Okay. We turned that around. Not bad, guys. It's gonna be a three for three at level one. But anyways, yeah, guys. We really, really excited level one. But uh, let's 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 keep our let's keep our head in the game here. We're playing the new buffed AP Misfortune support. Um, Riot and their infinite wisdom gave her a one hundred and twenty percent AP ratio, which is I believe outside of like Nunu's ultimate, which is three hundred percent. That's the largest AP ratio in the entire game. So. Uh, I, I know I spent a long time, you know, a large majority of like last patch saying like, yo, ADMF is so good, ADMF is so good. Well, it turns out not now with this buff, APMF is really, really good. Like you can legitimately notice like the uh, the difference in the AP ratio, even starting at level one. So we've got a harder scaling slow on our E. We've got better damage even starting at level one. And then we've got a higher AP ratio on our R. So we are... Oh. So we are going to be back to uh, just spamming, you know, this just kind of this like brain off version where we just absolutely decimate them with our E. And it's really fun. Oh, uh, no, no bounce there. Come on. But yeah, so full runes, guys. We got Arcane Comet. We got Manifold Band. Absolute focus. I think that this rune is absolutely broken, by the way. Uh, Gathering Storm and then Cheap Shot Ultimate Hunter. Oh, uh, it's bad. We got a nice little combo here where my E slows them. Gives them an easy... Oh, my God. They almost... Almost got her. Yeah, we got a nice combo where my E slows them, and then Jin can just root them out of it. Yeah, this has always just been, like, one of my favorite ways to play Misfortune. Like, yeah, you know, experimenting with her in AD was fun when it was good, but... Obviously, Riot wants us. To, obviously, I, I don't know. I, I feel like someone at, like, Riot Games, like, literally just has to have, like... They're, they're just an AP MF one trick, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know why she gets so much preferential treatment with this build, but... Because I don't really think anybody... Nobody likes playing against this style of MF. It is just, like, so toxic. Maybe we kill Thresh here. Uh, Not going to be able to kill him. I think we get out, though. Might have to flash. Do we though? Now nah, we just get the he just gets Dark Harvest. Anyways, uh, but yeah, someone at someone at Riot Games just has to be like an AP Misfortune one trick. But uh, we're gonna be going for Leandry's looking good here. They have like a slightly beefy front line, depending on what form Kane goes. But yeah, guys, let me know down in the comments. Do you guys like playing AD or M AP MF? They're both really fun. Uh, this one is definitely more balanced around like getting a lot of value out of your E and your R. Uh, whereas ADMF is like a lot more nimble and you're getting in more auto attacks and that's kind of how you do your damage. I think this this version is like much more relaxing to play. Like I'm definitely like way less stressed out when I play this because I just like walk up and it's like boop, hit him with the E, walk away. Not a this one's like much better uh, for long range too. But I mean just like look at that, like it's so brainless, it's so easy. You have to play around your E cooldown, though. It can be a little long in the early game. Yeah, I finally got a good bounce. I'm going to wait till my uh, my Comet is up before I use my E. Truly maximize the damage it does. Boink. It's, it, dude, it's just too easy, man. Like, I don't know. It just, it, it's just like instant dopamine. Uh, we've got Nidalee coming. Oh, beautiful spear. Got my E there. They're kind of like confused as to who to focus here, I think. Oh my god. Oh my god, no way. No way. Oh my god, and we got the Caitlyn too. Got the cannon, and we got the Thresh. It's going to be a three for one. Gonna put the uh, E on this wave, get the shoved in. Beautiful, beautiful. So 
So yeah, boys, I I can't stop playing APMF. It's just too, it's just too fun to have this like playstyle back. I'm happy about it. Bot lane good kiting on the cane. That guy got destroyed. True. All right, I don't. I think we kind of overstayed for this plate, honestly, but. Because Nidalee's wanting to do dragon, can't dragon. I think I, at least I need to take a reset. I can go there from base though. All right, so for boots, we're definitely not going Berserker's Grieve. See, like the the suggested items haven't really updated yet. I think we're gonna go CDR boots though. Just get that E on a lower cooldown. Get your flash on a lower cooldown. I don't think it's worth to go like actual um, magic pen, especially because I have other sources of magic on my on my team. So it's like I'm not the only. AP damager. But yeah, definitely don't want to go Berserk Greaves. I can tell you that. We can, uh, we can gank this. Mm, they're not wanting to fight, so I'm just going to get the XP from the wave. He was going to miss it. He was going to miss it, guys. Part of your duty as a support is to be the CS janitor and be ready to pick up any CS that your ADC is going to miss. And trust me, they miss a lot. Doink. Just a little doinking in the morning. No big deal. Uh. Okay, we got the dragon. That's all that really matters. Uh-oh. Well, he can't go in on it. So, I get to just run him down. Get to rotate to this first, too. I'm coming, I'm coming. Okay, no flash. Like, they all got out. Okay, I mean, we got the we got the dragon. That's what we came for, right? Dude, guys, not gonna lie. My hands are, like, super cold. You guys ever get that where it's like your hand like I don't know there's like not good blood circulation in your hands or something so good thing I'm playing APMF because this is like just straight up turn your brain off status don't have to do anything super super complex just walk up doink him with the E boom boom <laughs> I'm starting to think Thresh kind of likes being in my E. He seems to like walk walk into it when he doesn't have to. Just dance it in the rain, man. But like, look at this. Like, why is this so effective, actually? I mean, that was actually a really freaking good hook. I, I should have just kept continued walking across. I should not have ever taken uh, turret, turret aggro, but... So good. Two for three, or two for one. We get free plates. Looking good, boys. Might walk mid and help him get this wave in. Looking like he probably needs a reset here. One more wave. Okay, Silas has Yone ulti though, so I need to be like sl mildly safe. Once again, thankfully, APMF lets you do. Just stand three screens away and hit him with your E and run away. I almost st stole that, bro. How devastating to their jungler would that have been? I can really do a slow down the thresh here. Nice. Beautiful. Notice I put the E like super far ahead of her. Just in case she flashed. I mean like she has to go in that general direction. So even if she flashed, she was getting she was still getting rained on. Out of the wall. You might do something desperate here. I don't know, he doesn't really have a play. Neither do we though. It's a bit of a stalemate. Uh, 
All right, first turret at 11 minutes, not bad. All right, we have entire Leandries. Um, she's just dead. Oh, am I dead too? Might try to flash on me here. I'm just too ready for it, bro. Sorry. Is he a flash too? Woo. F, nice dodge. I mean, here's the thing is that like, if you think about things ahead of time, it, you don't always have to rely purely on like reaction time. Like, yeah, that's like a really impressive dodge to be like, oh my God, like, dang. She only had like a millisecond to react and she got it. But like, I knew, I even said out loud. Sometimes, not, I, I don't always say it out loud, but like, I'm always thinking about those things. And that one specifically, I said out loud and I was like, he might flash. So just like, knowing what they're going for gives you such a, uh, a leg up. Gives you such a big advantage. It's like flashing a Malphite ult. People are always just like, oh my God, bro, he flashed the Malphite ult. But like, if you know what Malphite's play is and you know he's going for the flash, you just have to be ready for it. But it was a nice dodge. But yeah, just like always be thinking about that kind of stuff. Be thinking about like, okay, Kane is chasing me and he's too far away to hit me with anything. Is he going to flash? Like, okay, Thresh is walking towards me. Is he going to flash flay? Then that can just like make you ready for it before it even happens. The secret to having superhuman reflexes revealed, guys. All right, time to start uh, making them regret playing this game. Oh man, he is wasting everything. I mean, we're on the E, so... Or, I mean, we're on the Dragon, so I mostly just, like, I'm trying to stall them out a little bit. Buy time for my team. Second might just be a flip. It's really hard to keep Blue Cane out of the pit. Okay. I can't do anything else over the wall, bro. <laughs> well, we got the dragon. We got what we came for. Uh, looks like Soul's going to be Mountain Drake. Not bad. Wink. Almost at 1,000 damage for Comet already. How ridiculous is this build, man? All right, uh, second item. Demonic Embrace is good. Rylai's Scepter Crystal is really good, too. Um, Rylai's is okay, actually. It, it, you, you get value out of it on your Q and your R, but your E already slows, and the ways that slows are calculated in this game, it's not like if you give them a 20% slow and then you hit them with a 30% slow. They don't have a 50% slow on them, right? So I actually feel like I don't get a lot of value out of Rylai's. We'll, we'll just go for Demonic. Okay. Not the best uh, Malkai alt I've ever seen. Oh my. Oh my. Hit reset. Freaking Yasuo windwalled my alt, man. Get out of the walls, bro. Okay, Caitlyn's pushing bot. We should play for their blue here. Oh, and their... We just take everything, boys. It's all ours now. Can I have this, actually? Oh my god, she's actually giving it to me. Oh my god, she actually gave it to me. Yo, let's go. Alright, now, now we have to carry this game. Okay, Silas Flash. Oh! Forgot Leandris gives me a turret aggro. Is 
Dude, it's just so funny. Like, I'm just like dropping an air support on them. Oh, baby. Oh my god. Well, I'm definitely gonna die, but I had a really nice ulti there. And maybe, maybe, maybe? No way. Come on, Nidalee. All right, all right, we take that. Well, we got dumpster. Wait, was Jin not at that fight? Whatever. Yeah, I mean, we, we got dumpstered there, but. Actually, it was only a four for three after we like took all their resources. So that's, I mean, that's totally fine. We're fighting off tempo anyways. Uh, Leandris has hit over f almost 1,500 damage. Comet, 1,000 damage. Like, it's so funny. Like, so much of the damage in this type of build, like, just comes from your items and runes. It didn't even need the damage, like, boost on E, but we'll take it, boys. We'll take it. It's two ADCs gliding across the lane. He's actually... Wait. Oh, my God. He, he almost got her. All right, don't get picked by Kane here. One minute on Mountain Drake. We should just like all be setting up for Drake here. But I wonder if I could get this Kane to like use his smite right before Dragon. What is happening, bro? What is happening, man? All right, there Yasuo is split pushing. We got Dragon in 20 seconds. Someone's got to go answer Yasuo. All right, uh, we just keep saving up for Demonic Embrace. I don't know, maybe Stork Shoes would have been a little bit better this game. Who knows? I like the lower cooldown on the E though, it's just really nice. W2 a minion. Oh, nice dodge. Okay. Slowed him. No, he has shield bow too. I think I can win this. No, man, no way. I needed one more Q. Oh, I'm so sad, bro. I had a really bad E over here. And then, of course, Kane came and bailed him out. But, ah, oh, it's such a bummer way to die. Blew both my summoners to rip. That's all right. We limit test, boys. We out here limit testing. Nothing wrong with that. Uh oh. Dude, Blue Kane is so obnoxious. Like, when you're playing a squishy, where are you supposed to hide from this guy, man? Oh my god, Jin, that's not where you're supposed to hide, bro. You can't hide in their base, homie. What is he? We got a runner, man. Don't really have anything to do for the next 60 seconds anyway, so it's not a big deal using my ulti like that. So hoping I could like corral him into Maokai and then Maokai kills him. Can't win all that, bro. All right, Mountain Drake in three minutes. They're blue up. Oh my god.
No, Nidalee, why? No, Nidalee, no, my god, she's dead. Be careful about giving Baron here. Oh. Oh. Ulti's up. Guys? <laughs> Alright, I killed Caitlyn. Got Yasuo's flash. Looks like we kill them all and we don't lose Baron. So that's best case scenario there for us, honestly. Uh, Morellos would be okay against them. They have like Silas and Blue Cane. My bad. All G. We got you, bro. Oh, tag him, bro. Tag him. Oh, so close. The reset and Baron. Guys, my fingers are like, my hands are so cold, I like can't even type. Weather's getting cold, boys. Hope you're all bundled up and ready for winter. Winter is coming. Yo, we should Baron here, honestly. Like, Blue Cane's doing dumb stuff, bot. Yeah, we should actually just, like, four-man Baron. And then just turn on whoever comes. We got like a good early warning system with the saplings. Oh my god. Oh my god. That was such a good freaking ultimate, man. Okay, now we got the now we got soul. We should push first before soul though. We should just like all push out mid together. Uh we shouldn't go for the end here though. This is this is where we get like roped up in like grief. Dragon. Okay, we do not give him a chance to steal this. I hate that he can do that, by the way. I mean, honestly, I'm down to just like run at him and die. Just to like give him something to do. It's not stealing dragon. Oh, nice. I hate Yasuo so much, bro. <laughs> I just grieve so hard. Whatever. Like I said, I wanted to make a play to just create space for my team to do dragon. It looked really good. If they didn't have a win wall, like that would have been such a god tier ulti, but it is what it is. Boys. Um, all right. Next, I think we just go like something like horizon focus. We got plenty of like HP percentage burn with like demonic and uh Leandries. Nice pickup, bro. All right. We should be near unstoppable now. My storm continues to gather. Rip. All right, um, once Jin's alive, we can just five man mid. Get out of the walls. Get out of my walls. Bro? Oh my God. 
My ulti just shredded them. Oh. Oh my god, let's go, baby. I can't believe that worked. Okay, don't stack for a Yasuo ult. He's dead. My auto attacks do like nothing. At least my uh my Q's like activate my items. Yeah. Wanna play versus me, bro? Versus me? APMF? The new and improved? Yo, where's our ADC by the way? Uh, my ignite killed her, I think. All right, nine, five, and 19. Not bad for, um, you know, not bad for support and for my hands being really, really cold. Not to use that as an excuse, but we made a couple of misplays that we never would otherwise. Uh, nine, six, and 20 is going to be our final uh, KDA. And then let's take a look at the damage charts because I'm excited to see if we top them this time. I'm gonna be real guys. I'm, I'm a little addicted to playing APMF support at this point. So Riot's gonna have to nerf her again for, for me to stop playing her. So let's look at the uh, the damage charts. I think we probably did like maybe first, probably second most, if I had to guess. Take a look. Oh, it wasn't even close actually. 34.6 thousand freaking damage coming out of APMF support. Riot, God bless you for the buffs. Much freaking love. Uh, let's take a look at the... Uh, here's the items and the uh, runes if you want to try this out yourself. Arcane Comet, Mana Flow Band, Absolute Focus, Gathering Storm, Cheap Shot, Ultimate Hunter, and then I went AP, AP, MR. I'm surprised it doesn't show like the, the rune shards here. But there's the items as well. You can mix up the itemization if you want. Uh, some people are saying that Demonic Embrace is not quite as good as it used to be. And that's true, but... You know, her e-buffs definitely make up for it. So there's the damage charts again. If you guys watch this on YouTube, let me know what you guys think of the build strat down in the comments, boys. Take it easy. Peace. Uh...